Welcome back, everybody. Today I'm taking a look at the Billionaire demo, part of Steam's October Next Fest event. If you're not familiar with Next Fest, it's when Steam puts up hundreds and hundreds of free demos for upcoming indie games. And there's a lot of stuff out there, too much to go through yourself. I played about 30 demos, talked to some other people, and their favorite games weren't the games that I played, and vice versa. There's just too much out there. So I'm trying to make quick review videos for the top picks that I played to hopefully get the word out for these games because they seem to be really great games and maybe some other people like them too. I've been playing them, all these games, on Twitch live, so if you're interested in watching me on Twitch or if you're interested in the full VODs of any of the um, games that I played, I'll have links down below, but let's just jump into the game. Billionaire is roguelike pachinko. If you're unfamiliar with the pachinko, it is a game where there's a board with a lot of pegs on it. You drop a ball from the top, it randomly, theoretically, hits these pegs, bounces in a weird way. You get points based on the number of pegs or where it lands at the bottom or any number of things like that. It's a fun arcade game. I think it's pretty popular in Japan as like gambling, but over here in America, I don't think we do that very much. Um, now, the thing about this game is that every time you drop a ball, you get the choice between random objects to put in the way. So I'm just putting a campfire down. That will uh, that will spawn a fireball every time I drop a ball. And that will give me more points and so on. And these effects stack on and stack on and stack on. If you're familiar with Bellatro, which was the roguelike uh, poker game that really was really popular um or still is really popular uh but came out like a couple months ago it's like that but for pachinko instead of for poker um so it looks pretty simple now i've only done like five or six balls or whatever uh but if we skip ahead things get pretty crazy pretty quickly so you can see the future state of my board here and while this first ball isn't too exciting these whales act as like ball collectors and then once it's, they've collected enough balls they shoot out a bunch of them all at once and so what with all of them together they just keep shooting back and forth pretty often and bouncing around and getting me tons of points i also have a lot of synergies with coin balls so you might see some coins bouncing around uh the bricks make coins the investment stock market in the kind of top middle wants coins and so does the piggy bank at the bottom and i don't know there's just so much to talk about with this game it's so exciting and fun and probably why it's a good gambling game, even without all these crazy things, <laughs> to be honest. Uh, but uh, I'm having a ton of fun with it, and it's going to be, it's on my wish list already. So uh, whenever it comes out, which there's no release date yet, as far as I know, at least on the Steam page, um, I'm going to most likely pick this up and have a ton of fun with it. So uh, thank you all for watching. If you're interested too, I'll have a link to the Steam game page down in the description and um, hopefully you pick it up.